Hi everybody, uh, just a quick video to update you on observations I made recently at the Fire Island Lighthouse. I'll, uh, I'll be showing you that and showing you the, the blog entry I made so you can come and look at that data. Um, there's the lighthouse. This is the triangulation diagram. You can see all the observations that were made from that lighthouse long ago. I, uh, I made some myself to the Empire State Building, which uh, was actually positioned long ago as a triangulation station. And this is an old triangulation diagram. Uh, another building I observed is uh, One World Trade Center or the Freedom Tower, which of course is not on this map. And uh, let me go. Uh, oh, and also I made uh, observations out to the ocean surface from a point. Actually, I'll highlight these lines. Anyway, you get the idea. Yeah, so I made observations from a point down on the porch in front of the lighthouse. And I also made observations to the ocean surface from up on top of the lighthouse. So let's go look at that. So here's the blog entry where I include some pictures establishing a position out in front on the porch getting my theodolite height, determining the elevation of the theodolite, and this is just a picture with the telescope set horizontal at elevation 17.9 NABD 88. Okay, and that's, there's the ocean surface, there's my telescope out, you know, looking out horizontally. Then I uh, recorded six sets of zenith angles in phase one, phase two position to the ocean surface I re and I give you my uh, zenith angle here standard error of two seconds then I went up on top of the light, up on top of the uh, lighthouse established a position up there again with GNSS and that position agrees very well when I processed it from this cores. Um, <clears throat> this is a continually operating reference station in Queens. It agrees very, very well with this benchmark that is up there on the deck. I supply you with that data sheet as well. And getting my height above the deck, I recorded uh, four sets of zenith angles to the ocean surface. And there's my zenith angle, standard error. Then I could see the Empire State Building, and uh, that is also a triangulation station, as you saw on the map. Here's the position. You can get any flavor of coordinates you want. State Plain, New Jersey, State Plain, New York East Zone or uh, Long Island, etc. And there's the uh, recovery entries for the Empire State Building. Uh, as you can see, my telescope is set horizontal here. I'm quite near the top of the building. Uh, there it is. Uh, there's the distance in uh, feet and miles for your computational purposes. Okay, here also is the uh, One World Trade Center building. It's just a link to uh, Wikipedia for the building so you can get details on it. There's a blinking white light up top. Here again is my telescope set horizontal. 
and it looks to me like I'm about midway up the building. I've provided no, uh, I didn't do any computations on uh, any of this. It's here for anybody that wants to take a look at this. Uh, here again also I point to the light and made four sets of zenith angle pointings there and that's the uh, zenith angle I came up with with a standard error of two seconds. And that's about it. Just wanted to put this up here for anybody that wants to take a look at this data and make of it what you will. All right. I've got some more coming. Um, yep, more is on the way. All right, thanks. Talk to you. Spread the word.